2k21 current gen and you guys guessed it we are on the triple upload daily upload series i've been doing i've been saying i've been doing since i came back from my little break but uh yeah we're back on 2k21 and today we are making a pretty it, it's basically like a stretch lockdown basically like it's a stretch lockdown it's like a perimeter lockdown or a two-way mid-range shooter but at the power forward position so it's a pretty good build you could run um, so yeah, yeah, let's get let's get right to the video. So for the position, we're gonna go power forward. Hand it doesn't matter. Hand doesn't matter. Andrew's number doesn't matter. But I'm gonna go with number zero because that's the number I wear. All right. So for the attributes or my attributes, I'm getting ahead of myself. For the pie chart, we're gonna go with the red and green pie chart. And then for the physical profile, we're gonna go with the fastest one. All right. So for the attributes, we're gonna go close shot. We're gonna max out close shot. Max out driving layup. Max out driving dunk. And then you can max out standing dunk. So you end up with eight finishing badges right there. Boom. You can do post hook if you want. Um, but I'm just gonna do standing dunk. I'm gonna do standing dunk. Standing dunk. So boom. We end up with eight finishing right there. For the shooting badges, we're gonna go max out mid range, three pointer, free throw. And we're gonna put our post fade all the way up. Uh, you can get 19 um, shooting badges if you want. You, you can get 19 shooting badges if you want, but if you do 19 shooting badges, I'll recommend bringing this down to like a 76 right there. And then we're gonna go down to defense. We're not gonna do nothing on playmaking. We're gonna go down to defense. We're gonna do interior defense, perimeter defense, lateral quickness, steal, uh, defensive rebound, offensive rebound, and block. So you end up with 18. So this is only if you want 19 shooting badges, but this is what I recommend doing to make this build. So we're going to do a, we're going to go with 16 right here, 16. We're going to max out block or not max out block. We're going to go with 20 defensive slash we're going to badges right there. We're going to put our post moves up, um, not our post moves, our driving layup. And actually y'all, my bad. I actually messed up. So we're not going to do standing dunk, actually. We're going to do post hook. We're going to max out post hook, not standing dunk, right there. And then go with that, right? And then we're going to go down back here, 68, 68, 70. Um, you want to bring your steel down. My bad. I, I messed up. I, I told you guys to max out everything, but I messed up a little bit. So we're going to uh, bring down our steel to a 61, right? We're going to put the rest on our block. So we end up with 21. Defensive slash we run badges, and then we're gonna put the rest on our close shot. So you can, pretty sure you can't keep the standing dunk. No, you can't. So if you go with standing dunk, you can't get eight finishing badges. But so the only way you can get eight finishing bad, eight finishing badges is if you go with the post hook. So boom, I would just recommend doing something like that. So you end up with eight finishing, 16 shooting, one play making, and 21 defensive slash we run badges. For the body shape, um, I'm gonna go with like burly or. I'm gonna go with built for the body shape because we are gonna go minimum on the wingspan or minimum on the weight. Uh, it's really up to y'all. If you guys wanna look super skinny, you can, but I wanna look a little little burly because I am gonna go down on weight. So we're gonna definitely go with uh, built. So we're gonna go built the height. We're gonna go down to six seven right here. We're gonna go. Well, there's two ways you can make. It. You can make it the six seven way or six eight way. But I'm gonna make it the six eight way. So we're gonna go down. Um, to 6'8", we're going to go down to 2'10", I'm pretty sure. 2'10". Yeah, no, yeah, yeah, 2'10". We're going to go down to 2'10". I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure it's 2'10", or like 2'11". Um, is it 2'10 or 2'11"? No, it's not. It's nowhere near 2'10 or 2'11". It is... It is 202 right there. So we're gonna go 202. So we end up with a 79 speed, 76 acceleration. For the wingspan, um, we're get you can okay. So I would recommend going down two with the wingspan. So we end up with a 74 three pointer. So if you, your guard is running floor general or dimer, you could be floor general and dimer. You'll be good. Oh, excuse me. You could be really good with the threes, but if you don't care about that, you can go. You can just go um, minimum, or you can go up one, or two. 
but if you want to have a little bit more defense i would definitely go with 87 87.6 so we're gonna go with the mm, no we're gonna go stay because he's in that 74 driving down we're just gonna stay with the we're just gonna go one up from the minimum so we're gonna go 86.1 and then for the takeover uh you can go sharp i, I would recommend going sharp because you already have the defense so i would definitely go sharp shooting takeover and we have made a three level scorer three level score my bad a really really good build i like this build um three level score build is really nice basically like a stretch play uh, stretch lockdown basically what it is um so uh yeah i'm gonna get you guys the badges and then get you guys out of this video because i know i'm bothering <laughs> i know i'm annoying so we're gonna go slow three finisher slow three finisher silver showtime silver lob city finisher contact finisher silver and uh consistent finisher bronze for the shooting you want to do Ranger Stender Hall of Fame, uh, Hot Zone Hall of Fame, Fletcher Bully Silver, uh, Catch and Shoot Hall of Fame, Clutch Shooter, or not Clutch Shooter, and a million new Corner Specialist Silver right there. Those are just like the best badges to use for a spot up. For the playmaking, you can either go Unpluggable or Bailout. I would go with Bailout because you're not going to be dribbling the ball like that. So I would definitely go Bailout. And then for the defense slash rebounding badges, you want to do Clamps Gold. You want to do Intimidator Hall of Fame, uh, uh, Chase on Artist Bronze, Intimidator Interceptor Bronze, Rim Protector Hall of Fame, Rebound Chaser Hall of Fame, and then what you could do is you could do Post uh, or Moving Truck Silver, right? Post uh, Pogo Stick Bronze, because somebody might try to bully you, you know. So you want to do Moving Truck Silver, Pogo Stick Bronze, and then you could do Box Box um, Bronze. So, uh, yeah, that is the build. If you guys did enjoy the video, make sure you guys hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, turn on post notifications, comment down below what type of videos you guys want me to do. And, uh, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed the video. See you guys next video. Peace out.